The most important job of a catcher is to present pitches well so the umpire can make good, accurate calls. The best catcher frame in youth baseball I've seen coming up next. The specific pitch I'm going to show you is coming up, but first I'd like to set up the scenario by showing you this at bat during the 2018 Little League World Series, which is what reminded me of that impressively framed pitch. Here is what happened during the Michigan versus Georgia game. Eight as kids. Ball! Ball! That's one of those where you're set up as a catcher high and the pitcher throws it right down the middle. But tough to frame that one, make that one look good. In this instance, the pitch sequence was two curveballs low, followed by what was supposed to be a high fastball. However, the pitcher missed his spot and threw a strike just above the knees, almost dead center. The pitcher didn't get the strike called, and most wouldn't in large part, because when a catcher sets up like this, he's blocking the umpire's view. And when the pitch misses by this much, the catcher isn't able to show where he caught that ball, his glove ends up in the dirt. Now, this is a great catcher, and I don't want to imply anything negative in showing this pitch. He did an awesome job at catcher, and if not for him, his team would not have gotten as far as they did. So that is what we pretty much expect to see happen in this situation. Almost no umpire is going to call this a strike. But seeing that pitch reminded me of a game I coached recently. We had seen this exact same pitch only with a better outcome but I only knew it was from a game over the past two seasons. That's about 120 games where I'd have to find just one single pitch. So I asked the catcher if he remembered just one pitch from two years of catching, and he did, but he could only narrow it down to a seven game series. That was much more doable, and as luck would have it, it was early during the first game I checked. Here is a pitch sequence. This is one of the better hitters on this team, and he could do some damage, so pitch sequence was critical. He starts off with a curveball swing and miss. Next pitch was a fastball inside for a ball, one and one count. The next was another curveball he followed off, which means he's seen and timing that one up. So the coach calls one of my favorite pitches in this count to a power hitter like this. High inside under the hands. It's meant to be a strike pitch, but up and in. It's a swing and miss pitch when executed correctly. You see the catcher set up for this location, but the pitcher misses as far away as he possibly can from the intended spot and throws a strike to the low outside corner. And this is how the catcher handled that situation. Good job, Ryan. Right away. Good job, Joe. Yeah. Hey, you. You. Good pitch, kid. That's the most impressive I've seen. Yeah. Is that a psych job on it? For everybody, except for the catcher. Okay. <laughs> to be able to read that pitch and adjust quickly enough to beat the ball to the spot, center it in front of his chest, and keep it in the strike zone is very impressive. Thanks for watching, and if you're interested in seeing more impressive youth baseball videos, don't forget to subscribe.